currently in the northern end of the United States. You may have noticed the drop of temperature, the changing color of leaves, maybe some ice in the morning, or if you're far enough north, maybe even some snow. All good things must come to an end, and when you finally come to grips with the fact that it's time to winterize your boat, here is a quick checklist. On your engine, you should change gear and engine oil, as well as the oil and fuel filters. And while you're at it, change the transmission fluid. Flush the engine, circulate antifreeze through the engine block and manifold, and take a moment to apply grease to external engines and lubricate where appropriate on the motor. One last thing, apply an anti-corrosion film to the engine's external parts. For your fuel systems, you're going to want to top off your fuel tanks and add fuel stabilizer, also lubricate fuel pumps in the injection system, and run the system to check for leaks. For your electrical systems, you should inspect and repair all electrical wiring and connections, and remove batteries and store them in a cool, dry place. If you're going to haul your boat out, store it in an indoor, heated area, or at the very least cover it if it's just going to be on the hard. This is also a good time to wash the hull and motor and consider covering the motor surfaces with wax. If you're leaving your boat in water, you want to check for leaks periodically, and if you're concerned about ice, don't forget to suspend water agitators. Also make sure the battery is fully charged if you decide to leave it on the boat, and perhaps attach a tender. An empty slip is a sad sight, but soon enough the weather will turn. Good luck with your winterizing, and stay warm! For more boat stories and news, go to soundiesonline.com or check out our Facebook page.